What's going on people, it's Casey from www.kc-sounds.com So today's video is an unboxing video. I bought the Apollo Twin Duo from Universal Audio. I've been using the Focusrite Sapphire. I don't think you can see it from there, but yeah, I've been using that for the last good couple of years and I feel like I've kind of outgrown it now and I just need to up the levels and the Apollo Twin Duo is uh, for me the next next step. So yeah, let's, let's do the unboxing video and see how that goes. So yeah, I'm just running this off on my iPhone, so if it's back to front, mm, that's the reason the writing looks back to front. That's the reason why I don't know, I can't see because of the light, but I don't think that really matters anyway. So just quickly, there's the focus right that I've been using for I used on so many productions, recordings, and yes, yeah, it's, it's time to it's time to say bye, it's time to, to move on and evolve, you know. But yeah, this so this Sapphire Pro 24 DSP is it's nice. It does it does the uh, it does the job. It's done the job for me, and um, yeah, definitely I would recommend it, especially if you're like a new, uh, just upcoming, or just starting out producing or making beats or whatever it is. I, I would definitely recommend it. But so yeah, let's move on to the uh, the unboxing. So you can see it's got the black finish, kind of like a, a matte finish. Let me bring it a bit closer. Yeah, so it's got the matte finish, um, preamp buttons, monitor buttons. And it's got like the, the uh, LED lights there. I've been doing my research on these things for a while. So I know it's about got all the outputs, inputs, and the back. Yeah, sorry about that guys, I had to switch to the to the camera because the, um, the iPhone said I ran out of space. Uh, so as you can see, we've got the, the Apollo Twin Duo here looking fresh as in its box. I don't even want to take it out of the box. I'll just leave it in there. No, I'm kidding. And we've got the, the big knob there that does all the controlling. As I mentioned earlier, all the buttons. Talk back, there's, there's a new function on this one. I think uh, the last one didn't have the talk back on it. Monitor section and preamp section. Uh, let's take it out and see what's good. I'm just going to drop this down here a sec. So yeah, it's, it's a metal finish, just like the the Focus, right? Um, what can I say, man? It's, it's nice. It's going to fit nicely in that little slot where the Focus, right, used to sit. But yeah, I'm going to set it up. Do some recordings, make some beats through it, and see how, see how much of a difference the make makes to my sound. What else is in the box? Uh, we've got the what's this? Oh, getting started. And instructions there in the box. And we've got. I'm guessing this is the plug. Which they could have dropped a thunderbolt in there, but they didn't. That's not a problem. You can pick that up from one of your your local stores that sells them sort of things. You know, like the Maplins and the the KRCSs and that. I'm sure, you pick one up from there. I got mine from KRCS. And um, yeah, that's pretty much it for this first video of um, unboxing. More to come, as I said. Thank you for watching. Music is life. Peace.